Welcome back. Sooner Surge Softball Edition here. A little raw reaction from the uh, Kenny Gajewski uh, quote that's posted really all over Twitter. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, uh, Sooner Surge. You can stay up to date with all the content. Turn on your notifications. Okay, You won't get lost in, in this shuffle as you uh, we continue to throw out the content. But Kenny Gajewski talking about basically showing a little jealousy of uh, Kelly Maxwell transferring to the University of Oklahoma and, quote, saying uh, she'll lose everything she ever got here. Well, we know she didn't get a national title, so there's one thing she won't lose, and there's probably a whole lot of other things, and we'll get into that in a second. But, guys, what are your initial reactions on this? Unbelievable. Well, just an absolute, uh, if you ask me, a fraud of a quote. That's what I'll say. I mean, the dude is going out here bashing the player that almost took him two years ago all the way to the national championship against Oklahoma. If it wasn't for a few fielding errors, you would have been seeing Kelly Maxwell against Oklahoma in the, in the national championship. And the guy, the dude is a former Oklahoma alumni. He played baseball at Oklahoma. Now he's going on to bash, basically implying bashing his own university while his former player. So I just lose respect for him. It's absolutely ridiculous for him, of all people, to make that kind of comment. Because everyone knows he's an OU alum. He won a national championship, the last national championship that OU baseball has ever won. He was on that team in 1994. Uh, when Patty Gasso is gonna is bound to retire at some point, Kenny Kayeski is someone that would kind of think that, oh, I could maybe get this job because I'm an OU alum and uh, been pretty successful of a softball coach that has – had a lot of good seasons at Oklahoma State. And to say that about your pitcher is just – that's absolutely pathetic to do that. There's no well, reason for those comments to be made. And the fact that he just does it like it means nothing is crazy. Well, and, and, and you're right. He is an alum. The next job is going to be another gasso. But, hey, I, what he said is, is absolutely ridiculous, Okay. Jordy Ball transferred to Nebraska. Everything she did at OU doesn't matter. I mean, that, that would be like me saying everything she did at OU is done. She, it doesn't matter anymore. What she did at OU doesn't matter. That's not true. She took OU to another national championship last year, and I'm grateful she was at OU. And what he's doing is if you're a transfer player, I, don't, I wouldn't want to go play there. No. Would you? No. I, I mean, if he's making comments like that, why would I want to go play there? Is he going to think that, that I'm whatever I did past doesn't matter? I don't know. I think it's outrageous. It's ridiculous. It's almost, I mean, it's very childish in my opinion. And uh, we're going to see what happens next year when they face OU in Bedlam. And he gets freaking no hit by Kelly Maxwell. I can't, I can't wait. For, hey, the <laughs> other thing, though, he's making himself look stupid. Look, OU handled it. We just had Chris Plank on, and he even talked about, earlier today about how OU handled the Jordy Ball situation. Look, pure class, pure trash. It's not a hard comparison on how you handle things. And the other thing he said in there that I think was very telling is if you go on and read more what he said, he talked about that these kids, he kid, goes, and yeah, they're still kids. Okay, first off, uh, you're a kid, you're the child. But he said, they're kids, he said, that they're looking under their feet. They're not looking at 10 years down the road. Kelly Maxwell, the only reason she went to OU is for 10 years down the road because she's wanting to get the joy for the game again because she's going to get it around him. Hey, hey, so what, another thing, hey, another thing, though, is Kelly Maxwell, he, he, he said on his quote, he, he said, uh, she, she's not welcome back here as long as I'm yep. here. She yep. left you. She left you. She doesn't want to go back there. Yep. And and uh, just as Jason, you said, just the comparison of whenever J Jordy Ball left compared to when Ke Kelly Maxwell left, just the respect factor that these players got from their coaches and from their fan base. Kelly, Kelly Maxwell, you like you had to have seen the hate coming from the Oklahoma State fan base. We've seen over the years how whenever they react to the big-time players leave – we saw it whenever some of their football players transferred out. Like the Oklahoma, Oklahoma State fan base is just a bunch of salty fans that wants to be like Oklahoma because o o Oklahoma State will forever be the little brother to Oklahoma. And hey, there's an argument about it. I, I'm not going to bash – right now I'm not bashing any fans or anything. I'm bashing this coach. But here's the thing. You, 
People have to understand if this was just like Jordy Ball left for Nebraska. You know what? As an OU fan, and if I was Patty Gasso, when I, when I play Nebraska next year, I want to run roll Jordy Ball. There's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with wanting to dominate her when we play her. There's nothing wrong with OSU wanting to whoop OU when Kelly Maxwell pitches. But the comments he made are silly. Just like Brent Venables does in football, if you leave us and enter the portal, you're gone. You're not you're not with this anymore. That's fine. Go your own way. Best wishes. But don't make comments like nothing mattered at OSU when you were here. You've lost everything. That's silly. Those did matter. She spent four years there. Okay? Five. But – Five years there is whatever it is. But the fact is, as OSU fans, they should want to whoop OU, and they should want to whoop Kelly Maxwell. I have no problem with that. It's what he said that I have a problem with. Yeah, she's arguably the greatest OSU pitcher of all time, and you're making them comments that nothing matters. Like, like I, I can't remember. I think it was Jackson maybe that they almost went to the national championship a few years ago. Uh, it, it's just he's acting like the psycho ex, you know, like – there, there's no reason to go say that to a student run paper, what he said. Like, it's just, I don't know. You you would think someone who's been around the game, uh, baseball and softball, as long as he had, has, would know that you got to move on. You got to wish them well and not publicly slander them. Like, Yeah. And unfortunately, or fortunately for OU's case, I guess, fortunately for OU, unfortunately for OSU is, I'm not sure what this does to others in that program who see the coach react to this, someone who who they were very probably had a strong bond with, someone who had been there half a decade, okay? So uh, there could be some ramifications here, some consequences within their culture. That's not really what we're here to talk about. We just want to say welcome, Kelly Maxwell. Glad you're a Sooner. We appreciate, hey, and everything you do will always be part of Sooner Nation uh, because you're a part of the program. And you guys need to be a part of this program. Sooner Surge, as we uh, continue to uh, drop out some content, some raw reaction, we want your comments on this whole Kenny Gajewski quote, tweet, comment that he made. And until next time, guys, Boomer. Boomer. Boomer.